Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Before I get into it, it'd be massively appreciated if you went ahead and dropped a like on the video. Cheers. So as we all know, we've seen new Rangers player Todd Campbell make his Ibrox debut yesterday during a 2-0 win against St Johnston in Glasgow. As goals from James Tavernier and Glenn Kamara was enough on the day to get the job done and secure another three points in the league table this campaign. So it's been a hectic transfer window for us in Glasgow, with plenty being said regarding incoming players with not much done in terms of players actually signing, leaving plenty people to believe we need to hurry up and get business done, or potentially miss out on players arriving this campaign, which wouldn't be great after seeing all the hype this transfer window. However, it would be what it is really and we would just have to move on and accept whatever happens with that. So this news actually comes from ibroxnews.com who went on to say, Standard Liège are willing to leave Nicholas Raskin in limbo for six months now, unless Rangers can meet their one million asking price this campaign. It's also understood that Rangers have had a second bid of 750,000 turned down, after seeing an initial 500,000 offer turned down as well. However, it's believed Standard Liège are determined to hold out for their valuation of the 21 year old midfielder, who was previously valued at 7 million according to transfer for market.co.uk. It should also be noted it's also been suggested Rangers are now preparing a third bid for the midfielder, who just has six months left on his current deal. So it's also being said if Rangers are only 350000 short of their asking price, then they should simply pay that this campaign. He's a young player with immense potential which fits the mould Michael Beale is trying to bring, as the Rangers boss is eager to add some long term value to his squad, and the likes of Raskin and Todd Cantwell certainly fit the bill. It would also appear standard Lays have no problem asking Raskin to sit in the reserves until the season is done. However, Rangers Rangers do need to try and call their bluff slightly, and 1 million is a significant sum of money that the Belgian club would most certainly rather have in their account, as opposed to an unhappy player still on their books this campaign. So what do you guys think then? I personally think we will see this happen before the window shuts and we can't do any more business. I think we all know how long January's been now with not much business done really, with only the arrival of Todd Cantwell being anything notable for us at first team level, meaning we do really need to get a move on if we want to add more players now, and I do hope we do go on to meet their asking price when we do make the third bid for the midfield. Fielder. But let me know what you guys think down in the comments and subscribe for daily videos. Cheers.